<laughs> so, uh, by round of applause, uh, who here has uh, stolen money from their kid's piggy bank in order to drink beer at uh, an open mic? No one, eh? I have a feeling we're not going to relate. Uh, I used to park in the handicapped spot at the bank. And if anyone ever asked, I would assure them I was retarded. <laughs> uh, so uh, I'm married, taken. But uh, before that happened, I had a bachelor party. It was not your typical party. Uh, by round of applause, has anyone ever heard of a uh, Tijuana donkey show? Couple people? Okay. Uh, has anyone ever received an invitation to a Tijuana donkey show? A uh, golden ticket, if you will. <laughs> no one? Well, let me explain. Does anyone want to guess? No? A Tijuana donkey show is when a girl, usually, blows a donkey to ejaculation, usually. Now, I want to make this perfectly clear. A Tijuana donkey show is not pornography, usually. It's more like a car crash you just can't look away from. Uh, so there's three things we need. We need a, uh, a donkey, a girl, and we need some midgets to referee the whole thing. My mother always said, there's nothing less professional than a poorly planned donkey show. So we need a donkey. Uh, we ended up stealing a donkey from a petting zoo in Saanich. A little heavy petting. Took him home, tied him up in the backyard, and uh, obviously compared cock sizes. Donkey won. <laughs> so we got the donkey, uh, and we need the girl. We're pretty sure we all know a girl who'd do it for like 10 grand. We didn't have 10 grand. We need the kind of girl who's going to do it for like 30 bucks and a Pepsi chaser. Luckily for me, I know a lot of prostitutes from work. So I find this girl with a, uh, a tight jean jacket and no self-esteem. <clears throat> and she's like, yeah. Blowing donkeys is kind of my thing. And I'm like, thank you, Jesus. But it turns out getting the donkey and the girl were the easy part. Do you have any idea how difficult it is to book three midgets for the weekend? Let me tell you from experience, don't try the local chocolate factory. Good on paper. Good on paper. We ended up hiring a uh, midget tossing act out of Winnipeg who agreed to do it for uh, travel costs and a positive Craigslist review. The Lord is on our side. So uh, with everything lined up, it's time to send out the invites. Dear sir or madam, you are cordially invited to witness the most spectacular of events. A girl with no self-esteem is going to suck off a stolen donkey facilitated by a gang of midgets. We hope you understand this is the rarest of invitations. No flash photography. Also, please do not judge the donkey based on the girl. RSVP plus one. So the big night arrives, the house is packed, the girl is escorted out onto the stage by two midgets, and it becomes immediately apparent to everyone that the donkey and the girl have a shared history. Bonus. <laughs> and so uh, she sucked them off yeah, less ejaculate than I'd expected and, uh, and that was it everyone went home last I heard everyone was doing great we gave the midgets a 5 star review and business really picked up we took the donkey back to the zoo in Saanich and he loves people more than ever and uh, the girl used the, uh, the event as the motivation she needed to get clean. Everyone's rock bottom is different. Last I heard, she'd opened up her own petting zoo in Arrington. All right, guys, thanks a lot.